Hello friends, today we're going to try one of those weird little games I got, Culling of the Cows. I don't know what we're going to find here. I, I did get to play a little bit of it because I found out that I had turned off the actual window to record the game. So we didn't get very far before I looked over and realized it was completely dark. So we are going to go here. Now, a couple days ago, I got warned that a bunch of my videos got flagged as completely inappropriate for viewing by people of all ages and had to go through and take care of that. So that's where I've been, has been doing some YouTube administrative junk. So let's call some cows. Uh, I've got some things I don't like about this already, but uh, we're going to start over. And we'll, we'll start with the tutorial. WASD moves around. Quite the tutorial. So it did take me a minute to figure out how to reload. That's useless. So, the one thing that I did learn is that you can't shoot and move, you can't reload and move, so you better be darn happy where you are when you go to shoot or you go to reload. Because you become firmly planted when you pull that trigger. A bit of ammo doesn't last long. Okay. I missed a bunch of times because it's kind of hard to judge where they're going to be. All right, so that is that one. So now we move to this one. It doesn't matter. Seems a little inaccurate when you're shooting. Maybe a mod with a laser scope might be nice, but. <clears throat> Cheap shot. Did upgrade the ammo once. That actually worked out pretty well. Reloading is still a pain in the butt.
where I found out the other ammo works really well. <clears throat> Whoops. I mean, I like the little switch up they did on tower defense games. Here's a little variety. That was because we used the door saw so we could get our extra money. All right, so we're here. And we missed some shots, so we'll go down here. Seems a little high there. Might have been handy to have before I refilled the ammo. I like the ammo better. going for the box and he slipped by. And my infinite ammo is gone. Ah! He comes in at such a weird angle. This totally throws me off. sit there for a minute. Oh, it disappears. I need to reload.
power-ups don't last very long. Getting a little hard to see in the pile that I've built up. Anyway, the upgraded shells. Oh boy. That, um, uh, Reloading will get away from you if you're not paying attention. Okay, so you got to kill all of them with the exploding cows. Reloading and not being able to move while reloading is kind of getting to me. Keeping up with this one and keeping it reloaded is, is a challenge. There we go. Okay, here's where it gets stupid. Alright, so in order to proceed we need to do one of these more I guess what they are is challenge levels. Okay, so here's our target. We're up here. Got that one. Not sure about this. Sometimes it really just seems like it shoots where it wants. I mean, I wasn't even aiming at that. I wasn't anywhere close to it. I've aimed at this one a bunch of times and have not been able to hit it. I was aiming at that one. It shot that one. Uh, that's not even a same angle. So I have no idea. All right, and this one's pretty messed up. I was not able to get past this one. I guess it's a bear? Anyway, it sucks. This one looks challenging. We got two boosts. Don't upgrade weapons. Avoid missing shops. Shots don't let any cows pass. Let's, let's give it a shot. Hippies. Who knows how them city folk got all the way out here. Some of them hippies found their way onto the wrong farm. Get them. Uh, 
up. Okay, that one kind of sucks. The lead up on it is horrible. Okay, the reload time just sucks. It kind of ruins the game for me. It's a lot of reloading. I guess we're really uh, two at a time now. That's better. Honestly, it's still not great. But better. in faster now. You get through. The not being able to move and reload is really ruining this for me. I don't understand where it would be so game breaking because you anticipate you're going to end up up here when you stopped here and then you have to move. So you can't really dodge well but uh, this thing's just becoming an exercise in frustration the aiming is not great the I, I don't I don't really want to finish it because uh, I'll show you the bear but he's just ridiculous See, I can't reload fast enough. Because you can't shoot and reload, and you can't move and reload, so... I don't know. This, this game is just... <sighs> a lot of frustration. I'll try it again. I'll try the bear again.
I have a damage in this thing? No, I can't. I can't even reload fast enough. I can't. I was actually just typing on the R key the entire time, and I can't keep up with it. This game is not fun, and I'm not going to play it anymore. I think that's the the worst, most scariest thing is that the game is bad. Well, some of you guys wanted to know what this was like, and uh, now you know, and now I know. Uh, I'm done with this. Anyway, tune in tomorrow. We'll play some more scary games. I uh, want to check up on some things. There's some uh, licensing things I'm checking on for some of the bigger games. I'd hoped to have answers on most of those before now, but I didn't get my answers, so... Uh, the games that I want to play, haven't heard back from the publishers, so I'm still waiting on that. So we're playing lesser known games. But anyway, uh, I'm still also fighting with my unsuitable for all viewers crap that's going on. And uh, that's making it fun. But we are <clears throat> not playing this game anymore. This will be culling of the Steam games. Anyway, I'll catch you guys later. Take it easy, and uh, thanks for watching. And if you had uh, any intention of buying this, uh, go just buy a real cow instead. Probably be more fun. Actually, trying to catch the spaceship in the intro is more fun than the actual game. Anyway, I'll see you guys later. Just take it easy.